Fit Institute revealing seven of the highest paying work from home jobs you can start this year and how complete beginners earning $100 to $700 a day with no experience needed. More with that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that Soul Spots have opened up for this week's free workshop, where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. Sign up for it in the link below. We have a 62 year old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days, so check it out now. All right, guys, so check this out. I'm literally at my home. Here's the table, here's the kitchen, here's like, you know, the couches, and there's the chairs so that, you know, the dogs don't pee on the couch while we sleep. And right now, I'm literally at here at home, working from home with my several work from home jobs. And you can see, even just from one of them, we pulled in $346 thousand dollars in net commissions right but I don't share you this to impress you or to brag but to impress upon you that if someone like me someone who started off literally in a cubicle wearing scrubs dealing with paperwork all the time working for somebody else that didn't actually appreciate what I was worth if someone like me could go ahead and do this then what would be stopping you from doing it understand I'm not the smartest person in the world I'm normal I'm average if I was able to do it then what's stopping you and little we even have people in our community that do the exact same work from home jobs and we're able to go from zero to 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks like Dina has stayed home mom at age 47 years old, right? So before we actually begin, I want you to keep an open mind because regardless where you're from, if you think you don't have any time, they say your job is taking up too much of your time or maybe you have kids and you're just so busy and you're like, well, man, I don't know if I can do this work from home job thing because I just don't have the time. Just keep an open mind because there might be something in this video for you. Because here's the thing, you know, what a lot of people don't understand, the hardest thing to actually get started is the ability to earn not working at a cubicle, right? Because when you think about it, when you're working in a cubicle, when you have to go to a physical location, you actively have to trade your time for money. So if you don't trade your time for money, you don't clock in and you don't clock out and you don't make any money, right? Well, the beauty about you know starting a work from home job and the reason why I wanted to start it is because it was one of the opportunities where it felt like my boss didn't have to micromanage me and then I could finally start separating my time from my income, which is ultimately where you wanna get at because if you could separate your time from your income, then you could actually start making more while working less. Like how awesome would that be? Just imagine you being able to make more than you make right now, but at home, now working less hours. And the beauty about that is when you're able to go ahead and work from home. Now, why is this actually possible, especially this year? Why is it that we're moving towards this entire blueprint of the ability to work online and from home instead of you know working at a job? Because it's kind of like where the culture is going. Like as you can see, more and more jobs are going online. More and more businesses are going online. And now more and more people and more and more business owners are realizing that they're actually saving money if you work from home. They don't need like this big office, they don't need like all of these things, and, and it's giving you like the perfect leverage. We are like in a pivotal point right now in like today's day, age, society, economy, world, landscape, politics, where it has never been easier to work from home. But with this big transition, with this big change, with this big, you know, like pivot, you gotta start asking yourself, okay, well, if I'm gonna start working from home and I start these work from home jobs, what should I actually do so that in the next five, 10, 20 years, my income will just go higher and higher and higher as my, the time that it requires me to go ahead and do this goes lower and lower and lower and lower. Well, what you guys gotta understand is you gotta focus on the jobs that will always be in demand, and number two, will allow you to grow as a person and increase some type of skill set, right? Like, why do you think the people that I interview that started working from home and work from home jobs, like the people here in Bali, like this 11-year-old girl was able to turn on $30 million, or this guy that makes a million dollars from profit. They first started with like a simple work from home job gained some skills on accident, even though they had no experience, and then started leveling up, right? So what would be that skill? Like what would be that skill that allow you to go ahead and kind of like blossom and bloom into someone that would be of high value, high status, the ability to actually earn and increase your earning potential without trading your time? Well, there's really only two things, sales and marketing, sales and marketing. I know this sounds like really weird, but Mike, it isn't selling sleazy or Mike, I have no idea how to do marketing. I didn't know how to do that either. And as you can see, I figured it out and I'm not the smartest person in the world. And the reason why is because when all of the businesses start moving online, the products online, the delivery online, now what's the most important thing to this business owner that's giving jobs? The most important thing is trying to get their products and services in front of people online. So if that's the, the biggest goal and intention of a business that hires people for work from home jobs, do you understand that the more you understand how to help them market and sell their product and services online, the more valuable you become? Which is why the first work from home job that I ever did 
was I literally found an existing product online that did the delivery and all those things. And I did something simple. I understood one thing. I was, I was young. I didn't have any experience. I had no credibility whatsoever. So I was afraid that no one was going to listen to me, right? But I had an earlier mentor earlier on. Like I remember when I first met him um, and, and he was just like making seven grand a month, driving an E-class Mercedes, had bigger biceps than me. I didn't like him because he literally embodied who I wanted to be like. And what he told me is like, Mike, when you first get started working at home, sometimes the best thing you could do is shadow underneath someone else and understand and let people know that you're just a beginner, that's fine, but you edify and leverage some other third party source to do the selling and marketing for you. And I was like, huh, interesting. So what he told me is he was like, Mike, your only goal is we're gonna have an event. Um, it's gonna be physical, right? And in this physical event, your only goal is to get butts into seats, okay? Literally get butts into seats. And I was like, okay, like just get butts into seats, awesome. And I literally did that and that's how I made my first like a thousand bucks, right, a month consistently. Um, and that was literally just extra money in the side. Now this was offline, right? But understand that now this exact same, you know, work from home job exists online. You know, if you literally go to, for example, munchi.com, they have all of these digital events that are always launching and happening and you can sign up for free. And you can see that these people will do a digital event where at the end of the digital event, they will go ahead and promote the $3,500 coaching program where they're essentially gonna, for example, help the people that sign up to build e-commerce stores, businesses, help them with their health, their marketing, their fitness, any goal they have, there's a program for any of that. They give 50% commission. So understand this, if I was just getting started and I wanted like a really high paying work from home job, something that would potentially pull in like nearly $346,000 in net commissions, I would number one, wanna do a work from home job where it's highly leverageable, meaning I don't, I could come in with no experience and leverage the existing resources like, you know, like, uh, like a leader, like a mentor, like um, somebody that will do the sales and marketing with the product that's just already high proven, that's proven to convert. And I would just do one little itty bitty job, which would be just marketing. In this case, it was like outbound marketing, just getting people, reaching out to people and getting them to this physical location. But now you could do it digitally with like the products on munchai.com and literally it's free to go ahead and sign up. And like I said, if you're just getting started, I would go ahead and recommend looking at this because this is something that also works. Like I even still do this to this day. Like when I need 10 grand fast, this is literally what I do. Now the second work from home job that I did uh, was something that was like super easy. You don't need any money to get started. You don't need any time or experience. But I literally went and copied and pasted pictures from Walmart all the way over to eBay. Now the coolest thing about this is you can see three have been sold. It's a thousand dollars. You can see this exact same product exists on Walmart for six hundred and ninety nine dollars. So I got this to the point where I was making a hundred dollars a day working from home, simply just copying and pasting pictures from Walmart to eBay. When someone would buy from eBay, I would take the money and the shipping details, buy it from Walmart, ship them over to, for example, uh, eBay, right? So just those two things alone, that, that generated me a good amount of commissions and, and, and sales and profits. And this is someone that didn't have any sales skills or marketing skills, but I learned a lot from it. And I started realizing why I should start taking this seriously, right? Maybe I should start learning like advertising and marketing, right? Um, and that's one thing that I ended up diving into as the third high paying job is because like I said, if you can advertise and market for some other business that has the budget to spend on advertising, you become valuable. Like you could see on um, Upwork, right, where people get clients, my sister gets clients here, she's able to travel around the world, live in Thailand because she gets clients from Upwork. But you could see Google ads, people like this guy earns $200 an hour, $400,000 earned. And you can even see someone like, for example, Steve B pays $100 an hour or gets paid $100 an hour, has earned over a million dollars. But Mike, I don't know any advertising and marketing skills. I'm like a nurse, I'm like a dentist, I'm a doctor, I'm a lawyer. Well, you can literally get certified for Google ads with skillshop.withgoogle.com. And you can see if you click on this, click on Google ads, you can literally take the free Google ad certification, get certified. I had a lot of family members who are super Filipino who like their parents were like, you have to be a nurse. You have to be a nurse because this is a Filipino destiny. And they started switching over to learning Google ads and now they make more money than if they would have chose like, for example, their nursing career. Does that make sense? The next one is something that my sister started in, right? It's literally managing Pinterest accounts because you can see Pinterest account manager earned over a hundred grand, $75 an hour. And Pinterest is very simple because a lot of business owners are on Pinterest. You can see I use Pinterest to uh, get 110,000 monthly views. And all my sister does to go ahead and manage my Pinterest account and where she gets clients, same thing, is literally go to Canva Click on the word Pinterest, have these like Pinterest pins that are automatically done for you with all these templates, 
And all she does is make these simple pins on this free app, which you could like go and sign up for, which is Canva, right? And you can see that she just mixes and matches this and uploads it on Pinterest. That's all a Pinterest account manager does. And the reason why they pay you that much is because it also makes them a lot of money. The next one is uh, something also very similar that I enjoyed is ClickBank. Again, I wanted to be a little piece in a big machine that wouldn't pay me hourly, but would pay me commissions. That's how I would get paid the most money. So ClickBank's a really good way because it's one of the ways that I went back in 2018 from zero to eight grand in 30 days. Like where else can you go ahead and start a work from home job where you don't need any product or service or even no experience and go from zero to eight grand in 30 days, okay? So you can see exactly why I really enjoy it and you can see when you go ahead and sign up for free, there's a bunch of products that you could go ahead and already begin promoting and making money with, like dietary supplements. Instead of you starting your own e-commerce business, imagine being the marketing branch of an e-commerce business and they'll spend all the money, but they'll pay you most of the money with no risk to you. You can see $150 commission. The six way is selling on Amazon, but not in the way where you have to spend a single dollar on inventory. They have products like, for example, Merch by Amazon.com, where you could essentially sell apparel. Like if someone comes in and types in Beagle gifts for women, I can go ahead and start my own t-shirt business working from home, just selling designs and putting them on Amazon. And whenever someone buys this, Amazon will literally go ahead and pay me in passive income. One of these designs can make you $100 a month in passive income. So if you, your goal is like $1,000 a month working from home, you just need 10 winning designs and we have a bunch of free tutorials in the links below. Just check out the 77 passive income guide in the link below. But ultimately, I think the best way to make money working from home with this number one work from home job is literally what people did in our community like Dina, a stay at home mom, going from zero to 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks. And if you wanna know exactly what she did and 100 of normal ordinary people did as well then sign up for this 60 workshop below check out this video on this podcast video see you guys later Woo!